This is Sam Tickle with Racing News. We are now through the first leg of the Saturday running of the Connection on Newfound Flandern. As you can probably hear, there is a bit of wind and the clouds are starting to come over, but it has remained dry for the morning stages. And it has been Adjo Firmore who has really taken advantage today. He's extended his lead, he's now got a lead of over 40 seconds, now from Sebastian Bedro. With uh, Bedro putting in some solid stage times, particularly on the last stage of the day, where I was able, able to overcome Kevin DeMarcello in the new Ford Fiesta R5 Mark II. So it's been a, a strong morning from those three. There's been no real mistakes or real errors. Uh, uh, Fenomar has had just the absolute now right pace this morning to uh, really, really build the lead. Then we come into uh, the others, uh, Prince of Ashura is, is fourth. But still, the real surprise now is that uh, Chris Princeton continues to struggle. He's now more than 40 seconds off the lead in his polo. It looked like maybe he, at the beginning of the day, he was able to find something find the setup that he wanted but his initial pace was very short-lived and while he did get up to third he's since dropped back down the standings so it really does appear that this is a rally where unexpectedly but that Adrian Fremont can really get himself back into the title fight and take some really, really valuable points off Princeton. There are now uh, two loops of five stages left, so we're still talking over 100 kilometers left for the day's running. Like yesterday, the weather looks like it could change. Whether it does and what we have, what we'll see as the night comes in, will be interesting to see. Elsewhere, Bob de Jong still leads in the Dutch category. The throw entered, has crossed, entered into the TER, so he leads that. And Bjorn uh, in his BMW currently does lead the historic category. And finally, Dimo van der Maro does lead in his uh, Opel Adam in the RC4 class. We'll be back as the day continues. As we said, two more loops. So check out www.racingviews.com for more.